welcome back to Lucas channel. <laughs> Today's video, nag-aantay na kami na so ayan, welcome back to my channel guys and today we are going to Ilo Ilo with my friends. So this is actually Maja's first airplane ride so sobrang exciting. We arrived in Ilo Ilo at around lunchtime so after checking in the Airbnb, we went straight to Tatoy's and that was our first meal in Ilo Ilo. We chose the original branch by the beach for the vibes. Pero sinabihan naman kami ni Kuya Driver na hindi maganda yung beach dito. So as you can see on the next video, yan, madun siya. Maraming basura. We didn't actually get to the water anymore. View lang talaga siya. But here's the food. Thank you, ate. That's the oysters. And the highlight was really the shrimp. After namin kumain ng lunch, we went to Carmina Balay nga bato. So, it's basically an old house that is home to a famous chocolate baterol. So, yeah, may pa film showing eh, may sila. And then, we can go around the house. And daming gamit actually, full of antique. It looked more like a storage than a feature house kami. Alam mo yun, hindi siya makang bahay na tiniran. Mukha siya talagang nagbibenta ng mga vintage stuff. Sobrang daming bagay-bagay. And then after you tour, you get to try their chocolate. It's 180 pesos per person with the chocolate already. So, ayan. The next day, we went to Carles for Islas de Gigantes. So, it's a three-hour drive from Iloilo to Bangkal Port. Ayan, we're in Bangkal Port already. And then, so we had to leave like 4 a.m. from Iloilo City to get here on time by 8.30 for our boat to leave. We just joined a joiner tour group thing. Ayan. So, this is us on the way from Bangkal Port to the first island. It was one hour. And the first one is Kabugao Gamay Island, where the famous selfie island is. Ayan. Ang ganda ganda ng water, but it was super hot. Sobrang daming tao. But, syempre, for the picture tayo, guys. Ang clear ng water. Look at that. So amazing. And yan, it's mismatch. Behind the scenes ng kanyang IG posts. Bonga. Then, yan. Swimming sila. Sobrang ganda talaga ng water dito. Grabe. Then, this was the second stop supposedly. The sandbar. Pero high tide. So, hindi na namin siya nakita. Hindi na kami bumaba. And then, Antonia Beach. Famous for the rock formations. Ganda rin dyan. We just stayed for a while until we went to the next island. Which was the mini Boracay. Mini Boracay kasi daw yung sand niya is same as the Boracay fine white sand. Pero hindi na rin kami bumaba. Kasi high tide niya. And then the highlight was the Tangke Lagoon. Sobrang ganda dito. The, the rock formation is just so amazing. But again, and daming tao. And yeah, I'm zooming in my friends right behind this white man. <laughs> they actually kabot din namin siya. But yeah, hi friends. We were actually stranded here for over 40 minutes because isa lang yung entrance and exit and naguunahan yung mga bangka sa pag-drop off and pagsundo ng mga tourists nila. So, medyo hassle yun at sobrang nakakagutom siya. So, yeah, beware. Dito rin kami na sunburn and sobrang init talaga. Grabe yun. So, next island is Lantawan, I think. This is where we ate our lunch. So, only scallops. Ang sarap ng scallops nila but it's just too much for me. And, yun. And then for the last island, we went to Pulupandan Island. Like, swim na lang kami dito. There was nothing much to see. But it was the last stop before we headed back home. And it was another three hour drive. So we got home almost 9 pm na kaya. Straight to dinner na kami at Ondoy's. And ang sarap ng food dito. This was our favorite um, meal for the whole Ilo Ilo trip. Bonga. And then we just walked around this area. I call it their BGC slash Eastwood area kasi mukha talaga siyang ganun. But I think it's the festive mall near that. We had dessert at Mama Ka, their Froyo. Sarap siya. There was, ano, butterscotch. Very island vibes talaga. Ayan, so we just walked around Shudad Sang Paghigugma or the City of Love. 
In fairness, Iloilo is really something. It was such an amazing experience. Next day, we had a city tour. So we went to the Molo Mansion first. We just really rented, or yeah, I just messaged someone from Facebook, a driver, tapos, ayan. Tinur niya niya kami around, and it was pretty worth it, I would say. And dami naming na puntahan. So, this is the Molo Church naman, right across the Molo Mansion. And the Molo Plaza as well. Tapos, ayan, Assumption Ilo Ilo. That's an Assumptionista. <laughs> and then we also passed by the Chinatown. And this one looked so much like Escolta in Manila. Sobrang amazing. I was really amazed. Buhay na buhay siya. Old school vibes pa rin. And then we went to the prison of Iloilo. This was my personal highlight of this tour. Because they turned this into a sort of museum. Um, managed by the National Museum of the Philippines. And sobrang ganda ng mga galleries nila. Super interesting. I could spend the whole day here reading through everything because it's very local. Siya. Like here, oh, your first photographer in the Philippines. So cool. So amazing. They even have these puzzles to make it interactive. It's so entertain and the challenge that I'm And then we had lunch at um, La Paz. So we tried Netong's original La Paz Bachoy. Recommended to ng mga locals. Daw, I think. And yeah, it was really good naman, in fairness. 130 pesos lang yung balaking bowl na yun. Then we passed by the Lo Lopez Mansion. Then the John. On the way here, sa Casa Marikit. So this is another interesting place. Um, old house din siya, na owned by Lopez as well. Tapos, ang entertaining lang nung pag-tour ni Kuya Caretaker. Kasi dami niyang kwento. Tapos, he loved taking our photos. Nilalagyan niya pa ng mga filter. And dami niyang pa-eme. So, worth it naman siya. And after that, we went to Biscocho House to buy pasagubong. Sarap ng Biscocho ng Ido-Ido in fair. And then, Belfry, Belfry Tower. And of course, Haro Cathedral. So, there was mass ongoing at this time. Kaya, nasa labas lang kami. Then, marami pang mga mansions around Iloilo like this. So, talaga ang daming mayayaman sa Iloilo before and I feel like until today. Tapos, ayan, bumalik na kami here sa may BGC area nila. Um, there was a car show ongoing where the target was ito, Ilomoka or Iloilo Museum of Contemporary Art. It's actually a three-floor gallery or three-floor museum. Featuring contemporary art, malamang, na local. Sobrang ganda ng mga pieces, sobrang um, entertaining. I don't know, I was very much satisfied. My eyes were satisfied, my heart was satisfied with all the art that I saw that day. Very cultured kami ng araw na to. And ito pala, right beside it is the Brandy Museum. Very small lang to, um, sponsored by Emperador. Ikot -ikot lang kami sa lugar. History of brandy, basically. <laughs> and then for our last dinner, we had chicken sari sari before we went to the airport. Ayan, pa uwi na kami that night. So it's a very short but very sweet trip with my friends, and I really enjoyed it. And I would love to go back to Iloilo. Sobrang ganda ng place. Thanks for watching!